what we have here we're all talking about what we can do to save our planet but what about our pets and how can they make a positive impact on our environment look at who's here our eco entrepreneur anthony zolesi and the eco dog what's the eco dog's name eco dog is sandy with a cape no less yeah but they're absolute with a cape and she's a little disturbed <laughs> yeah. to be on the set we understand it's not this about thing. being on the set it's about what's going on in the planet this is eco dog and i'll do anything to get this message out even come with a cape dog well tell us what your message is in. well the message is basically every purchase that we make can have an impact on the environment look at this dog just right. by buying the right pet food this this dog alone can eliminate a couple thousand doses of antibiotics, 600 doses of growth hormones, just by eating a certain pet food. We want to reduce the dog's carbon paw print. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah. <laughs> and, and if you're buying product, right. you can look for things like, like right here, it just says no, no factory farms, no antibiotics. Oh. You know that this is from small family farms, and that's what's critical. So this dog, just in the purchase that you make for pet food, can make a difference. Now, I know you have the dog here, but you also point out in research how hog farms, for example, they can pollute more than the island of Manhattan. That's a whole lot of pollution yeah, on a daily basis. In one day. Basis, in in one one day. day. Yeah. So what can you do about situations like that? Well, look, buy proteins that aren't from factory farms, and, and, and you, they'll be clearly labeled, either natural or organic and no antibiotics and no hormones if you grow the animal where it does isn't confined and, and can turn around it, you don't need antibiotics and hormones and something else you suggest is buy safe household cleaners which is something we yeah, really don't absolutely. think about what are safe household cleaners well you know most household cleaners are caustic acid based and you don't want that and so uh, you know some like this this is a great company um, they produce a product uh, that is orange based mm -hmm. so it's citric based and citrus based uh, but more importantly you know Better for the planet and better for your pet. Better for if the they planet, better for you. And also, we think about carpet cleaner because the dogs are, are of short. Course. But think about a toilet bowl cleaner too because that's very caustic. And a lot of dogs get their water from the toilet bowl, so, so that happens. Some simple things, but we can still like drive our cars and stuff like that, right? I mean, you're not. Well, yeah. Oh, but okay, good. All I'd say is, you know, again, um, you know, if you drive a lot, uh, look into a hybrid. Um, you know, we've got to start thinking about these things, and, and uh, that's that's why a dog, just the simple fact of buying products for a dog, can help you think about it. Because of products, you should be using anyway. All right. Does he fly? He's got a cape. He's, He's got, got a cape. He can fly. Oh, absolutely. <laughs> now, can you put him on the table so he can fly? <laughs> right down there. Well, let's not torture the poor guy. Dog. He'll be injured. <laughs> thank you, Anthony Zalesi, with Eco Dog Sandy. <laughs> All right. Thank you so much. Okay. Thank you.